It's kind of a part of the neighborhood for me. It's all it's, that get and go has been getting robbed since it was a come and go. Gabriel Kinzer has lived near the get and go on Hickman since 1996, so he knows what he is talking about. And unfortunately, this get and go being robbed is not new to him. It sort of blends in. I'm kind. Of, it is kind of. I'm mostly numb to it at this point. The other get and goes that were robbed are all in Des Moines. The store on Urbandale Avenue, the store on East Park Avenue, and Wednesday morning, the store on Keogh Way was robbed. It has Des Moines police investigating any possible connection. You can't help it, but you know notice some similarities. Um, our detectives are working though to see if they actually are connected. Sergeant Parizic says they are hopeful surveillance video from Get and Go will lead to an accurate suspect description. Those clerks tend to get hyper focused on their safety as they should. They want to get that person in and out as fast as possible. As for why Get and Go, Sergeant Parizic offers a theory. I think it uh, goes back to you know recognizing some of the vulnerabilities and uh, doing something to mitigate those so. You you're not such a, a desirable target. Desire may be the key word. Those living in the neighborhood say robbing a convenience store boils down to community-wide financial desperation. These people aren't robbing the gas station for fun. They need money. In all the four recent get-and-go robberies, a weapon was shown, was shown by the clerk or the clerk was told the suspect had a weapon.